It's legal to hunt lions in parts of the greater Timbavati Reserve. Lion hunting is a multi-million dollar industry in South Africa and has given rise to farms which breed lions for hunting. One such farmer is Pete Warren. He believes his lions are like any other farm animal. You tell me the difference between a lion and a chicken. A lion is an ideal farm animal. Why? Because it loves sleeping and eating. This lion at least has a five-year span, which I rear him to become a male trophy, which will then sit on the wall for a long time. These farmed lions are often shot in a small enclosure where they have no means of escape. It's an industry known as canned hunting. It's controversial, but legal and highly profitable. A white trophy lion can fetch up to $130,000. To produce the most impressive trophy lions, farmers often resort to inbreeding, mating two related lions together to guarantee a desirable trait, like pure white coats. As a result of these breeding methods, many scientists believe that all captive bred white lions are inbred. The problem for the white lions has been twofold. First of all, they were removed from the wild artificially over a period of about four decades. And in these hunting camps where they were held, they were inbred largely. So the second problem has been now that scientists are concerned about returning them to the wild because of this inbreeding. Some scientists, like Dr. York, believe Linda's captive-bred white lions increase the risk of introducing suspect genes into the Timbavati ecosystem. I definitely understand uh, the motivation and the rationale behind attempting to release white lions into the wild, uh, such as what's happening at Timbavati. But my real fear is that if one were to release certain uh, negative traits into the population, it's nearly impossible to go back once it's happened. If there's anything that we've learned from history is it's not nice to fool with Mother Nature. Although the father of Mara's cubs is distantly related to her, Jason and Linda have taken this into consideration. In their protocol, they say they will only breed their lions to unrelated mates. 